Oh wow. Yeah. Wait. Oh wow, I actually like kept the um like I don't I didn't need to change it. That's surprising. Uh Once upon a time, there was a fluffy white sheep. Watame. Uh, I don't like spending Christmas with so many people anyways. I'm, I'm probably going to be spending with like two people. <laughs> or maybe three. And like... Hmm. I don't know, because I... Because the thing is, right, I only really get to see my family, like, on holidays. So, yeah, I don't, I don't really, I don't really get to um, see them all that much, which is why, like, I kind of uh, tend to, uh, you know, I go to Italy, like, whenever I get the chance. Uh, the sheep fed on nightmares, so it lived off on the nightmares of the humans around it. Should spend it with them. Yeah, especially since I have like, like only half of it left. But one day, the sheep grew tired of the taste of nightmares. Just then, it saw a girl having a wonderful happy dream. The sheep secretly ate her happy dream. It secretly ate... Ugh, god damn it. Dream for 22 hours, does that to you. Uh, the sheep, the sheep secretly ate her happy dream. It was delighted by the taste. But the girl whose dream was stolen became a little more than an empty shell. The end. Yeah, you were tired. I, I, I kind of figured that. What was I born for? Why can't I eat people? Why can't I eat people's dreams? Is this okay? Is it okay to just eat them? I'd better go to bed. That's a little big on me. Well, shouldn't matter. Hey, can you really just take those? That guy was just sleeping. Sure, I can. I mean, I left him in my I left him my clothes, didn't I? And I blew, and I blew near all our money on your new clothes. Well, okay, but those clothes didn't they get real stinky when you found that horse stuff last town? Why can't I eat people? I th I s didn't I say why can I eat people's dreams? Like, I, I'm pretty sure I had dreams. And I'm pretty sure the can't was actually a can. <laughs> I don't know. I I don't know. Maybe, I, maybe I'm so high on no sleep that I just, like, I just forgot to add the dream part. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Did I? Probably. No, hold uh, you know what? No, hold on, hold on. Let me turn the light on real quick. Because I, I actually... But I, I, I need to see... I need to see exactly how bad my eye bags are. Uh, I, okay, I actually... They're not that bad. I thought they were worse. Yeah, no, yeah, no, they look normal. What the fuck? That... I guess the coffee paid off. Um...
I I kind of wanted to see like how bad my eye bags were, but it turns out they actually they look normal, which is I mean normal for me. It still looks so tired of shit, but you know like still. Can't complain when it's on the house. Hmm. Badge. What's that? These are what guards wear. You telling me that dumb looking doofus was a guard? A guard for a pl pleasure resort. Harrod. Close, but no cigar. It says Harold. So. Harold will be my name here. Hola. How works? That's what. What are they saying? Am I reading this right? That's probably easier for you to remember. Oh, how were? Okay, no, I was not reading it correctly. I just realized. Gotcha. You okay, bro? No. <laughs> I I think streaming for a, we're reaching twenty three hours. Uh, streaming for twenty three hours. Yeah, that was uh, not a good idea. Uh. <sighs> Wonder if they'll recognize me by face. I did try to mimic his hair. If we're lucky, we might even get to stay the night in this resort. But any hitches, and we're making our gateway. Got it? Whose idea is this? Uh, mine. But don't don't read the description. Oh wait, actually no, not the description in this one was different. Uh, d don't read like my community tab. <laughs> what kind of place is it? It's got fun and games. We got everything you want. Uh, fun, games, hooray. Don't get too wild now. Welcome to Azure Town. This is our prize resort. But only authorized personnel are allowed inside, currently. Yeah, you yourself? Uh, yeah, kind of. Like, a lot. <laughs> so, who are you? Name yourself. Yes. Number 3055. Harold Radford. Reporting for duty. Harold Radford? This must be a new guard. This must be a new guard that was to start today, brother. Uh-huh. Harold, how old are you? 18, sir. I see. I might say, your eyes seem so mature for a man your age. Good eyes. Eyes that have stared down death and made it out alive. But still no alcohol. That'll get you fired on the spot. Hmm? Who's that child? Effie. I'm Papa's... This is my little sister, Effina. Uh-huh. You don't look anything alike, though. We don't look alike, either. So we shouldn't speak ill of... Those sim of these siblings now, should we? Uh, that's sad. I'm Shin. Yeah, I know.
in what way do you not look alike? Is it alright if I ask you something? Certainly. Would it be possible for us to lodge a while at the resort? Hmm. Perhaps is best if it uh perhaps it's best you ask the manager. Have you some need? Actually, we're looking for our mother. Our dad's already passed away, so we left home without hesitation. And now we're trying to find mom. But we need money for that. So I just have so I just have to keep taking brief jobs like they like these. I see. It would be perhaps too costly to go to an inn uh, in both time and money terms. What a thoughtful youth. Personally, yes, I would gladly accept. I firmly believe that the manager will allow it as well. Thank you so much. I get it. You have green hair and your name is red while you, your other account is named green and the hair is red. Uh, that's so high they start voice acting. I, I, I would... I thought I already tried voice. I, I was voice acting like the whole time, but I, I, I don't think my voice is different enough. And also the, yeah, no, like the 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 green account. Yeah, that one came later. The real reason was something else. I have a clip of it somewhere. If anything should come up, feel free to count on us. I am the elder brother, Tom. I am the younger brother, Mars. Okay, thank you again. May happiness come to you. Somewhere in the abyss? No, it's on it. it it's in the, it's in my channel. You'll find it easily. Hold on. Uh, where is it? Hold on. Uh, okay, there's... It was surprisingly a while ago, okay, seven months ago, uh, there it is, there you go, it's right there. You're 18, Papa? No, that's drinking age. Uh, found the guy's age along with his badge. Oh, and those dogs could talk. That's so cool. They're not dogs, they're humans. What? People used to have all kinds of categories and races depending on how you look. But now we just call everybody humans. So what's different between those guys and dogs? People walk on two legs and talk. Anything else is an animal. About the only creatures that look human but aren't called. Oh god. About the only creatures that look human but aren't called it these days are dragons. What's different? What's different between dragons and humans? I guess that dragons can use magic and people can't. People can't eat lies or be immortal or pass through walls and floors. And a human's head doesn't split, doesn't spit fire when they're half asleep. Let's look for the manager. Forgot to ask what they even look like. Huh. What's over here? The newspaper has a suit, has a big headline. Phantom thief, uh, Phantom thief strikes again. Lots of books. Lots of books. Lifeless eyes. Sad. <laughs> A lot of books. Mm-hmm. 
Okay, um, let's just keep it moving forward. That's funny. Yeah. What's here? Oh, it's locked. What's this? Expensive looking alcohol. Oh, hello. Oh, do we have customers? This isn't the place for games. Whoa, look at the size of those! Pardon me, I'm Harold. And I'll be working here as a guard for a little while. I was looking for someone, the manager. But you see, since I'm new, I'm not even sure what kind of person I'm looking for. Oh, is that right? The manager is a woman, with bandages around her face. I think you'll know her right away once you see her. I see. Thank you very much. I heard this new guard was a younger kid, but you look pretty mature. It's an honor to hear you say so, miss. <laughs> uh, she went out a bit ago, so she might not be back quite yet. Uh, she's never gone long, so perhaps you'll bump into her if you just walk around. Is this an action game or mystery only? Uh, there's some uh, action scenes here and there. Like there's like a like a Pokemon like battle system, ish. I must mention we do get quite a few unruly guests. But good luck with the job. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. A wooden rocking horse. Uh, still no one here. Okay, didn't think so. Uh, okay. Not exactly somewhere we can go. Alright, guess we just walk around now. Somewhere. Wait, is there? Oh yeah, I've I already been there. Have I been here? Yes, I have. Oh, wait. You weren't here before. Eh? Visitors? Still getting ready here. Sorry to interrupt. I'm Harold. I'll be working here as a guard briefly. Harold. Oh, right. Gotcha. I heard about ya. If you want the manager, she should be back soon. What's the manager like? The manager looks real sour, but she's got a good ass. And them legs. Whoa, another one? Didn't see you there, shorty. And I'm, sh and I'm sure surprised to see you've got a kid. You knew I wasn't Harold from the beginning, didn't you? Yeah, cause I'm a friend of his. Cause he's a loser. Yeah, cause he's a loser and an awful drunk. So truth is, I hate his guts. Yeah, not really. Yeah, not really a good combination. Don't worry, I won't tell any. I won't tell nobody. Heck, I'm thankful you're here instead of that jerk. What an asshole. <laughs> but maybe it'll be trouble. I know. I'll make a prank call. <laughs> you're just like Kyle. 
Say what, Runt? How is this guy like me? Huh? Huh? You are. Hey, passed up guy. Uh, list your three favorite things. Oh, the name's Lucas. And I guess I like beer, money, and women. See? The same. No way, this guy's a womanizer. Me, I'm what you call a gentleman. Got that backwards, bud. You picking a fight? They're exactly alike, but maybe that doesn't mean they can get along. Hey, Mr. Lucas, what else do you like? Oh, well, given the job I do, I like seeing people be happy in fun-filled places like this. What the heck's that? You lied. Get on it, runt. Enough with the runt stuff. Call me Effie. It's my name. Oh, shit. Okay. I hate that they always hit first. Fuck's sake. So this girl can make lies manifest and eat them. You told a lie, so it appeared as a monster. Oh wait, I, I looked at I I, I mistook, oh, for a different person for Lucas. Oh well. So this girl can make lies manifest and eat them. You told a lie, so it appeared as a monster. Um, so you actually hate seeing people happy. Hmm, I see. Not so much hate. I just don't care. I gotta admit, people's sorrows seem a bit more on the interesting side to me. What a weirdo. Hey, look who's talking. I'd say the same of you. Would other people's misfortune, misfortune actually make you equally happy thing? Oh my god. I need to learn how to read. Um, I swear to god, if I get one more message asking me if I fucking prepared the briefcase. Ugh. Would other people's misfortune actually make equally happy things happen to me? Sounds like a pretty lousy way of thinking. Yeah. Boy, you're weird. But when hell gets sad, it makes me sad too. Seriously? Then you're a weirdo too. Oh. So we're all weirdos here. Hooray! <laughs> so... Is it... So, is the tiny one a dragon or something? Well, correct. Yeah, well, we've sort of got one of our own. A dragon, you mean? Well, it's a kid the manager picked up somewhere a couple months ago. You prepare your brief- I <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you. He eats dreams or something. And only dragons can do that kind of magic stuff, right? Of course, never seen him myself. And the manager says he's a human, not a dragon. A dream-eating dragon. The cops never got in your case for hauling a dragon around. Hey, not like we're doing anything wrong. I only take her along because she's unruly and she does weird stuff. Hmm, gotcha. Oh dang, I gotta clean up before I get in trouble again. Alright, beat it guys. Manager's gotta be back by now. Yeah, good luck. I don't need a guy like you cheer me on. Maybe that intel that... Maybe that intel that there was a dragon in town was right. Finding info this time? Yep, info on dragons as well. Plus, we might even learn a thing or two about... About you. Really? Really? 
Oh heck, what happened here? I I just timed him out as a joke. I did, I timed him out as a joke. <laughs> because uh Because I'm going to Italy in the in a few uh because I'm going I'm going to Italy tomorrow. And uh and I and I literally at fucking eleven PM at night Fucking 12 a.m. for them, they're just telling me, like, oh, have you prepared your briefcase? I got that message, like, three or four times, like, yes, yes, I did. <laughs> and I was like, I swear, I, and I just said, like, oh, I swear to God, if there's one more person that asked me that, and then he asked me that, and I was just like, nah, fuck you. <laughs> Fair enough, yeah. Uh, also, where the fuck is my charge? My phone charger, my phone's dying. That's right here. So my stream monitor. What's got you so happy? Wonder if that manager's back. Let's look around some more. There they are. Um. What do you suppose I'm about to transform into? Penguin! A penguin! I see. Indeed. I guess as good as any. You'll see that there's nothing up my sleeve. Three? Two? What? Are you really gonna turn into a penguin? Up one, be one, two! One. Um, the answer was a sheep. Where'd that woman... She vanished instantly. Hell, I was watching. Wow. So, are you a customer? No, surely not. To be inside at this time, you're a trespasser. Ow! Wow. Ah. Miss, why? Why? A little girl? Ah, Tom and Mars told me about you. So you're the little sister of the new guard. Beg for your life. Ah, uh, no, I meant to say, I've been most impolite. Apologies, I used to be an executioner. I still have some habits. And... You struck me as exceptionally shady, so are you hurt? No, it's fine. It's really my fault for making such an abrupt request. You mean lodging here? Oh, not at all. There are guest rooms on the second floor which you may use. We have spare rooms, so yes, you can certainly use the far room on the west side. Your main duties as a guard are to patrol the interior and prevent trouble between guests. But there are occasionally some rowdy hot-blooded ones. Report those to me. Report those to me, please. Uh, so you can transform them? No, so that I can bring them... <laughs> no, so that I can bring the whip upon them. I'm really in your debt. Ah, I should introduce myself. I am Sophia... I am... There is no way I'm gonna say that correctly. Joanel. Sophia Joanel. And to my right is... I'm William. You can call me Will. Will? Are you a dragon? Oh, you're back. <laughs> it's been five minutes already. No, no. I have horns, yes. But they're sheep horns. Oh, so they're different. Well, I, oh shit. Worth it. <laughs> actually, not, speaking of coffee, I, I should probably make some. Actually. I, I should probably make some more. Well, I have other preparations to make, so if you'll excuse me. Bye-bye.
But goodbye. Hey Runt. If you straight up ask someone if they're a dragon, they won't just say yes. Why not? I keep telling you dragons are rare creatures. Since they're rare, bad guys target them. That's why usually they hide it, you know? The police guys yeah, the police guys can be more open about it because they're strong enough to protect themselves. Hmm. But you never really stop me from telling people I'm a dragon, how? I don't like this conversation. Let's find our room and rest. Hey, for real, tell me. Uh, which one was it? It wasn't this one. Oh. Uh, wait, the farthest one. This one, okay. I've got work to do tonight, so I'm gonna rest some. If you don't bother anybody, uh, if you don't bother anybody, you can wander around and have some fun. You're gonna work? Because I came here as uh, the guard herald, see? I'm no pro impress. How can your... How can your time out so long? Usually it's two minutes? No. Usually it's five minutes. Like, I'm pretty sure that's is that even something you can change? Usually, like, the default is five minutes. I'm no pro impersonation. But it's not hard if it's my first time meeting these guys. Don't talk to yourself out. You mean physically or in terms of lying? Um, both? Right, gotcha. If you leave the resort, don't head into town. Place you to tell. Oh, and here's your snack. Eat it when you get hungry. Yay! What? I wanna play. Let's play! Nah, I don't wanna expend my energy. E expend my energy on, on you? Sure. Let's play. Not happening. Then give me something sweet to eat. I just did. Some more. More. Ahem. Uh -huh. Just a little. Stop shouting. It's ringing in my head. Please. Alright, fine. Here. Now go play elsewhere. Hooray. Why? By the time someone last stream, it usually says 112 20 seconds. 120 seconds. Hmm. Hmm. I guess she changed it because normally, like, and like I've I've modded for like a lot of people, right? Like. Like, I have, like, even now, I have, like, my fair share of mods. And, like, I think it always was, like, five minutes on, like, every single one of them. I didn't even know you could change the timer. Hold on. Actually, let me, let me check that, actually. Hold on. Uh. I'm out. Timer. Moderation tools. Uh, put participant in timeout. Timeout allows you to temporarily prevent someone from sending messages to the live chat. Won't be able to send messages for five minutes. Is what it says. Imagine not being able to chat for five minutes 
Hey, it happened. Happened to me. Happened to many people. Oh, it just happened to you now, so... <laughs> what? I'm not giving you any more. You have some too, Al. Sweet things make you happy. Sh sure, thanks. Hehehehe. <laughs> this candy was mine to begin with. <laughs> Alright, let's go see what... What we can do. Oh. oh. What is it? I wanna play. Let's play! Uh... Let's play! Ch sure, okay. You asked if I was a dragon before, right? Yeah. If, if I... You know, if I were a dragon... Would you know... Wait, would you know why I was born? Or why dragons are born? Um... I don't know. Even the dragons I know haven't told me that kind of stuff. Oh. Like me, I can eat lies. But even I don't know why I can. You eat lies? So you're like me. You eat lies too, Will? Well, not lies, something else. I can eat I can eat them because nothing else makes me full. But I don't know why I'm able to, I don't know why I'm able to either. I don't know. That's okay. It might take a while, but you'll find out. Really? Up is a big liar, but I won't lie to you. I'll try to find out too, so don't look sad. Okay, thanks. I'll do what I can, too. It's something I don't know about myself, after all. By Papa, you mean that big man from earlier? Uh, keep it secret, I call him Papa. Uh, keep it secret, I call him Papa. I'll get in trouble. Okay, it's safe with me. Sometimes I'll call Miss Sophia Mom, too. Oh, good, so it's not just me. <laughs> you must really like your dad, huh? Yeah, I love him lots. I can tell. You have such a tasty smell. Eh? Huh? Forget I said that. Hmm? Said what? About? Nothing. I need to get ready. So, I'll see you later. Okay, bye-bye. Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> Alright, so I was creating a freaking story in my head because of because of that music. Yeah. Also. Uh I wanna talk to them. Hold on. I can't. I can't get on stage. Yeah, I'm at I wanted to talk to them. Dancing, yeah. Ooh, the big booba. Um. Oh, what's the matter? I wanna play. Those cards look fun. Oh, you like cards? Yeah. The front and backs are both really pretty. <laughs> I see. Now let me show you a little trick. Ooh. I have four randomly drawn jacks, queens, and kings. Pick any card you like. But don't tell me. Just pick one and remember it. Hmm. Picked one. Right then. I'll flip them and collect them. Then I'll cast my spell and... Do you see the card you chose here? And don't lie to me. 
Hmm, let's see. Hmm. It's gone! Then I succeeded. Huh? How? Did you know what I was thinking? It's a simple magic trick. Jacks, queens, and kings are detailed but hard to tell apart. Most people will only look at the design and the suit. So I switched them out entirely. Whichever card you pick, it's completely different. So your, so your chosen card vanishes. Whoa, could I do that too? Yes. You ought to at least learn to learn the switch out technique. Smarter people will notice right away though. Oh, uh, then Hal would probably get it real quick. Oh man, I wanted to leave him speechless. Don't look so down. Here, take these. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Don't mention it. There he is. Hey, Missy. Wanna play with me? Sure. Hey, where are we playing? See, besides serving drink, uh, besides serving drinks, I do tricks here. Wanna see me practice? Tricks? What are these? Playing cards. With just a deck of these, you can you can play all sorts of games. Well, it's got different pictures on each. Uh, on each, pretty. <laughs> Never seen anybody get so enthusiastic and 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 enthused, enthused of a card. The fuck? Now pick one, anyone. Just don't show it to me. And hey, write your name on it with this pen. Got it. Um, written. Good. Keep it face down and put it in the pile. Atta girl. Now I'll shuffle. Whoa, speedy. Tell me to stop anytime. Hmm. Stop. Alrighty. So little missy. Isn't this your card? That's the one. Success. Wow. Whoa, good job. <laughs> it makes me smile to see you so glad about it. Oh, hey, Missy. What's your name? Efina. Then you spelled it wrong. It should... Should be... E-F-I-N-A. You wrote Efana. Ah, uh, I thought I got it right. Just a little off. You'll get it next time. Yeah! Alright. I'll let you have the Ace of Hearts, my dear Athena. That pen you used was erasable, so just rub it a little and it'll come off. Yay! Thanks, Mr. Lucas. Hey, Mr. Lucas. Are those stitchy scars from your injuries? Eh? They're for style. Got real ones too, though. Oh, so... Al, is he stylish too? Is it trendy? Huh? He's got scars too? Yeah, he's got stitches around his belly button. Huh. Where'd you get hurt to get real scars, Mr. Lucas? Oh, my girlfriend stabbed me. I tell ya, she acts so grateful, but she's got me on lockdown. Can't go chat with other women. Don't grow up to be that kind of girl, Athena. I don't really get it, but got it. Gonna be night soon. Customers are coming. I recommend staying in your room when they're in here. 
not wandering around. Okay. Alright, see ya. Uh, what is a, uh, what is a house that doesn't have doors and windows? I don't know, a sandcastle? Fuck all I know. Huh? A lie? Whose? Like I care. I'm hungry, so I'm gonna fill my tummy. I don't... Wait, wait, wait. I do want it. No. It's a mushroom? No. Huh. Why? Because of Toad's house? <laughs> I don't get it too. I mean, if it's... <laughs> I mean, if it's like, I was, because like, I mean, Toad's house, that, that's a mushroom, that's a house, but it has doors and windows. <laughs> I hear a bunch of chattering. People coming, I guess? Hmm. Now what? I'll go back to Papa for now. Why did he do these tricks? It's such a mystery! Oh, she's so pretty. She's got a kid with her. You think she's married? Oh, a lie. I don't have a girlfriend. Oh, let's see. I'm going to die. Yeah, no, I am not finding that thing. All right, I'm. I am about to die. Go, just, just go. Take a rest. Yes. Okay. Now I can go fight that thing. I'm a, I'm a real hit with the ladies. Amazing. Miss. First, first thing. Do I have any skills? Of course you don't. Oh no. Why are you like this? Oh, okay. You missed. Mm. Oh, are you fucking kidding me? There we go. Okay. Let's heal. And let's talk to Piggy. It's time. I'm off to work. What should I do? Oh, well, if I know. Well, I guess it's pretty late. We got nothing to do, just go to bed. Aww. Sleep. Okay. And don't accidentally lock the door to the room. I don't want to have to sleep in the hallway. Fuck you, you don't tell me what to do. There are shit on the lies here, holy fuck. Want to play, miss? Sorry, but I have to play with some customers right now. Must be some other time. Gotta play to ease your fatigue. 
Hmm? This is... Oh no, I'm fine. I prefer to just watch. Uh, this table is made of clear glass, which must make it hard to cheat. Old maid, let's do old maid. Yeah, what's that? You sure? Oh yeah? Hey Effie, what do you need? Hey, I wanna see you do the card thing, which, which you did before. Oh, uh, I'm a little busy here, um... Alright, I know, look at my fingers. All stitchy. You got it. Now if I just do this... Wah! Ta-da! My thumb separated from my left hand. Wow, how did you do that? Again, do it again. <laughs> Obviously, I can only do it this once. What? Cheer up. With this, I won't ask for money. Yay, thanks. Can't believe she didn't notice my thumbs are different colors on each hand. Yawn. I'm sleepy. Should I just go to bed? Bedtime. Do you speak French? No, I speak Italian. Uh, also. What? Hold on. Someone just. Wait, hold up, what? Uh, wait, I need context for this. Oh. Uh, what? Wait. Where, where did he come? Wait. Are you fucking kidding? The okay. Uh, what what uh, language do you speak? Uh, I only speak English and Italian. And uh, speaking of that, uh, someone just commented in a community post saying Mario. Because I, I made a community post asking like, oh, should I do like a, should I do like, uh, oh, wait, he's telling me to play Mario because I asked what should I play. But like, this is bullshit. <laughs> I That's hilarious. This is... I'm I'm laughing so hard. It it's 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 so funny. I I forgot to laugh. It it it, it, it really it genuinely is. It's it's hilarious, really. Man, it's so funny that like, I I think I I I think I think I'm probably going to lose my shit. Oh, my clothes. Eh, they're not that hot, so whatever. Good night, me.
Up already? I love how sarcastic you are, yeah. Can't even talk to him. Oh, wait, wait. Who was that? I mean, I don't think I can. Alright, I'm in bed with a stranger. Oh, well, that's a lot of lies. Hmm? This dude get crucified. Yep. Is that? A dead guy? I... I... I gotta call someone. Is he dead? No, not dead. He's just knocked out. Next shows signs of a strangling. What now? Well, it's the dead of night. The manager and everyone's probably sleeping. <laughs> Since he's not dead, don't really need to hurry to tell it, tell them anything. How hard is it to learn the Italian language? I don't know. That's my first language. I just, I just, I just kind of grew up with it at first. Really? Why not? If we leave him here, whoever crucified him might come back to finish him off. Guess we'll keep him in our room until morning. I'll carry him. Then grab his necktie. Okay. Sleepy. Let's find the manager and report this to her. She slept by him all night? Yeah, that's my cake. <sighs> Better not wake her. Sounds like she's having a blast. The manager. Rise and shine, newcomer. Have a nice rest. Things certainly got rough yesterday. I can't believe you calmed that giant customer down so easily. What did you even say to him? Uh, I just told him not to trouble the other customers. With a knife held to his back. But I guess I concealed it well. <laughs> Manager. Oh, wait. He's asleep. Yes? Um, I want to talk. See, last night. I see. It happened again. Again? Some of the things have happened several times before. But the man does have a certain personality after all. One could call him karma. First things first, we'll ask him for details directly. 
Of course. Mr. Lucas is sleeping in my room. Understood. I'll go on ahead and wake Lucas up. Hey, morning. Good morning, Lucas. Mr. Lucas. So, do you know who put you up on that cross? Oh, I don't know about that. I can't remember. I just vaguely recall being strangled, maybe. As I thought. You did say this had happened before. Oh, Sophie, dear. You told this punk about it? Lucas, must I remind you not to call me that? Oh, right, right. I know, I just let it slip. Don't get mad at me. Is this the third time being strangled and crucified? It's the fifth. See, can't remember nothing. We're going to contact the police this time. The... Who the fuck are you is less hateful. Is the less hate Is the less hateful answer on your poll? Wait, I have a poll? Wait, which poll? Hold on. Wait, hold on. Um... Literally one person voted. That, that, that's... That, that poll literally got one vote. <laughs> yeah, and that's me. Oh. Huh. I thought someone... I didn't see it? Yeah, because it was like a month ago. I forgot about it. Yeah, it was a month ago. <laughs> hey now, Miss Manager. It's not like I'm hurt or nothing. No need to do that. You never contacted anyone about this before. Well, Lucas getting well, Lucas getting stabbed and strangled is almost an everyday occurrence. <laughs> we were never particularly worried, but the same incidents repeating is something new. And it'll be too late to look into and it'll be too late to look into once he's died from it. Don't talk like that, I'm right here, you know. Well then, I'll place the call. <laughs> I don't know, I'd vote for like every other one, aside from... <laughs> we'll be closing the resort for- yeah, we'll be closing the resort for today. Take the day off. Maybe I should talk with him again. You sure can play the part of somebody you're not, huh? What? No. Think not enough. Uh, think not enough of it. Just found it funny. You don't. Re you don't remember a thing. All the times this happened. Wait, you don't remember a thing. All the times this has happened. Yo, Yumi, how you doing? I'm back. How many hours has it been now? It's been 23 hours. Uh, but the thing is, because part, uh, the second part of this, uh, crashed, I now have to, I now added two extra hours. So this is a 26 hour stream.
Uh, so yeah, even though it's 20 minutes from 24 hours, I still got two hours. Yep. Anyway. <laughs> Soon you'll be three. Yeah, only two hours to... Well, two hours, 20 minutes left. Finally. Though not gonna lie, if I'm still playing this game by the time we reach it by the time we reach 2 a.m. I'm probably gonna I'm probably just not gonna end until I finish this. Cause I don't know, it disturbs me that I don't get to finish it. <laughs> just like I told you, that part of my memory is just gone. Wonder who's the culprit? I wonder too. I got no ideas. Or actually, more like there's way too many candidates to narrow it down. I'm a real sinful guy. Then you want to take the punishment. Don't go talking like Sophie now. But yeah, I don't think you're gonna get much useful out of me. Much useful info out of me. I've never been able to remember nothing. Uh, I've never been able to remember not in all the other times. I see. What? Gonna say you're actually a detective or something now? There always has to be a liar in these situations. And that runt... And that runt there eats some. This will take a week, tops. I'm not asking about his briefcase. Briefcase. The thing is, right? I literally. Okay, here's the thing about my briefcase. I did it on stream. I was on call like this morning. It was like, I think 9 a.m. I think. Something like 9 a.m., 10 a.m. I was. I, I literally was on call with Weber on stream just doing that. And you can tell I was doing that. I literally did laundry on stream. I did laundry on stream. What else did I do? Uh, I fucking well, I, I would say I made coffee on stream, but I do. I, I did that like ten times, like like today alone. But <laughs> laundry, on, yeah, yeah, yeah. I did fucking laundry on stream. Laundry SMR? No, it's in another room. The the washing machine is somewhere else. But like it, it the yeah, it's it's in another room. You wouldn't be able to hear it. Um. Yeah. Yeah, but you you can literally no. The thing is, right? I literally say out loud, like, "Oh shit, I don't have stuff to wear. I need to do laundry." And I, you can literally hear me just ravaging through my stuff, just going to just going to the washing machine to put the shit in i did that shit on stream oh and uh, and, and i just uh i swear to fuck i i look at my phone I look at my phone and I see like a good like a, a, a real life friend of mine who just messaged me like oh how are you doing and I was like oh finally a whatsapp message that's not from a family member literally the moment I think that have you prepared your your backpack over the like as well as the as the briefcase and rem remember the past oh yeah because I'm gonna forget my passport totally mm. Off with that, but I am gonna reply to this guy though. Hold on. Uh... Okay, anyway. <laughs> yeah. Now that I'm looking at the time, there is no way I can do episode 3 of this game. Oh shit, this guy just asked me what am I doing? Uh, um. Mm. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> The VTuber secrets. Imagine if he really forgets his passport. I will cut my arm off. 
I, I will literally record myself cutting my arm off. Fucking face reveal too. I will literally show my face on stream just cutting my arm off. I'm sorry. In fact, you know what? No, fuck this. Here's what I'm gonna do. Okay, that was not planned. Like at all. Okay, hold on. Let's, let's try this again. Um... What the fuck are these? Why? What? So, um, so, um, so, fun, so, so, fun fact, so, you know how you said, imagine he actually forgets his passport, I literally went to get my, like, one of my, my, my other backpack, this is the other one I used for uh, college, and I didn't feel like emptying it, so I, I, I was literally taking down my other backpack, two fucking wheels just fall on me. Two fucking, they're, they're like the wheels from my briefcase, right? I just, I, I just see like two things just like falling. They make so much fucking noise. And I'm just like, the fuck just fell. I turned the light on. There's just two fucking wheels <laughs> on the floor. What just, what, what briefcase do they belong to? That's the real question. Hold on, I'm gonna check this. Nah, is it? Don't tell me. This one has both of them. <laughs> which one lost? Which? Which briefcase just lost two wheels? Two wheels. What? What just happened? What just happened? I, I need to take my other one down. Hold on. No. No, I just, I just, no, 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 no. I checked. Both of my briefcases have all four wheels on them. So, what wheels do those things belong to? Were they just there the whole time before I even got here? That's literally the only explanation. Unless they're like the wheels of a shopping cart. Don't know why they would be there. Um, I, yeah. uh, I can't just sound sound like a crazy person. You, you wouldn't believe it. I, I am... Like not only is the stream making me go insane. But fucking my own house is making me go insane. I don't even know what is happening in my life anymore. <laughs> what is going on? I just fucking I have the world falling on me right now. <laughs> uh hold on. Uh it's, sorry, those are mine. Oh yeah. You want them back? Uh, this is what happens when you. I almost just clicked on stop streaming. I would have been pissed if I clicked on that. Um, this is what happens when when your phone told you to prepare, and here you are playing games. The but the thing is, right? I the thing I put one of my briefcases like on stream, right? Fuck, did two wheels just fall on me? <laughs> uh, it's like, no, are you okay? No, I'm. I. This is a sign of sleep deprivation. Uh, it probably is, I'm not even really joking. 10 plus cups of coffee? Yeah. That's just here. 
Why are you asking? <laughs> That's your wheel. A fucking... Literally, I don't know what they... What... What they even belonged? What do they even belong to? <laughs> That's the thing. I don't even know. Uh... Hallucinations. No, no, no. Did, did she hear that? Like, did she just hear two, like... Actual, like, metal things just fall? Because that's what they were. And all of that, while it's a game drug, the, the game has been stuck on this text box for the past five minutes. <laughs> I've been stuck on this text box for the past five minutes. I didn't even get the time to read this shit. And all of that while replying to three people on fucking WhatsApp. And one of them is asking me what am I doing right now, which is like, like I literally cannot even say. But I gotta make some shit up. Uh... Something about the wheel. That's what you call multitask. <laughs> I haven't even gotten the chance to read this shit. Hold on. Uh, and, and oh, and oh yeah, I was supposed to put my password in my bag. Oh. oh. Everything is happening at once. Everything is just happening at once. What is wrong with my life right now? Alright. Cool. I am forgetting the passport. It's in my bag. Uh. Uh. In this picture. Right. Anyway, now, if I can- oh wait, the light is on, never mind, let me turn that shit off. Now, if I can just play this goddamn game, I'm not even doing anything, I'm reading it. And I, and my earphone fell, oh, of course it did. That's just classic. Uh Okay. Okay. See the the reality is my functioning. Um uh, they call multitasking. Tell them about the wheels. The wheels I just put them back. they I just put them back on top of like on top of whatever that is. I don't even know what to call it. It's like a really high shelf, but like not really a shelf. You have a clip material now, funny wheels and insanity. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna leave that to someone else. I'm probably, I am probably not going to touch these street. Uh, like the only thing I'm going to do with this 24 hours, 26 hour stream now is I'm probably just going to take all of the games I played and I'm probably just gonna like make them into like separate videos. But yeah, in, in no way I'm like, I'm probably not going to touch this anytime soon. If anyone wants to clip it, go ahead. So it's yours. Yeah, are we good now? Well, I'm out of coffee actually. I need to go make more. Uh, You know what? Nah, fuck it. I don't need coffee. <laughs> I'm probably gonna get a heart attack. <laughs> okay. Yeah, make more coffee. Nah, fuck this. Oh, I see. I was wondering about that. Kid seems real fond of you. How about you? Uh, what cup would it be if you did? I lost count. Um, probably plus 10, honestly. This is there's not even a cup, this is a full on mug. Like it's it's a it's a mug. Oh 
Coffee limit is 44 cups. Uh, if I didn't care about her, I wouldn't be leading her around everywhere. Hmm? What? Oh, just looked like you were enjoying yourself. Oh, really? Still feeling a little sluggish. So, I'll be going to my room. I think you ought to care more about yourself first. So long. Good luck. Let's make some notes. Ah, I left my... Yeah. I left my memo book in my old clothes. Let's see. What can I write on? These tissues should do the job for now. Alright. Time to talk to the others. Uh. Also, I forgot to say this because I was too busy bitching. Hey, Astra, how you doing? Uh, his. I like how his um, his, like his pixel sprite just reminds me of, like a like a like a certain VTuber. He just does not look like what he looks like here. I have to say I'm watching San disintegrate, but I need to go now. Enjoy the stream as much as possible. Anyway, yeah, have fun. Party going to sleep. I don't know. What you, have fun doing whatever you're doing. Have a good night, probably. <laughs> We're gonna enjoy like a, a a good night's sleep. Meanwhile, there's me, just gonna have to stay awake even after the stream ends. Yeah, yeah, sleeping. Yeah, I think we're in the same time zone actually. Do good. Just going to be lurking for a bit. Yeah, that's that's fine. Probably. Uh, you know it's funny. That one of the probably one of the easiest goals out of the out of the like out of the, out of the ones that I set for the stream was to get to three hundred subs because it's it it was literally just set it it's literally just seven subs it's literally just seven but fucking whole fucking twenty twenty six hours of streaming I haven't I got I lost two subs. And gain two subs. <laughs> I got nothing. <laughs> and this guy is spamming me. Why? <laughs> anyway. Having missing memories kind of gives me this sort of squirmy feeling. Just one turn of you. Never been to my mother. Uh, this is the life of the YouTubers. I, I, I don't think I've ever seen like a, a single YouTuber that just that went through like this much chaos in like the span of like five minutes. <laughs> <sighs> I'm going to go now? Yeah, that's that's cool. Yeah. I'm gonna go watch Alice, you fucking simp. Uh, I mean, it's nice to not have the memory of being strangled by a girl. But there's lots of other memories I'd rather forget. Can't those just go poop too? <laughs> I'm on my... That changes nothing. It seems as though things are getting serious. I'd like to ask you if you know anything about this matter. Oh? Did someone ask you to do so? Yes! She said it could be awful for Mr. Lucas if this continues. The resort is closed for today, so she asked me to assist. 
Ah, oh, I see. I'm terribly sorry you got wrapped up in this, in all this just after arriving. No, it's sent from just cold truth. Hey, chat, Exodel. Exodel. Press Exodel. But, I need to attend to other things at the moment. Did you come back a little bit later? Yes ma'am, sorry to disturb your work. Keep hitting the mic, it's like right next to my face. Oh. What is it? We're close for today, so you can head into your into town to shop if you like. No, I'm fine actually. Oh wait, no, I'm fine. Actually, I was wondering if you knew anything about Mr. Lucas. About Lucas? Hmm. I'm sure you've already become fairly aware of his womanizing habits. He's always been this way, and he's stabbed, and he's been stabbed and whatnot for it, unspeakably, un, for it unspeakably many times. Yeah, crucifixion is too good for, um, mm. it's almost comical how he's beyond fixing. And there's a woman he's dating right now as well. Someone he's dating, would that woman be our own employee Olivia, the snake woman in the red dress, you know. The big breasted girl, huh? Um, are Mr. Lucas and Miss Olivia getting on well? Well, Olivia is a jealous sort. She's displeased to see him with other women. So long as she's looking, Lucas must not mingle too much with other girls. But as far as I can remember, they haven't gotten in any specifically big fights. Especially big fights. I see. Thank you. Thank you so much. I do hope this all can be resolved. I know. I'll do what I can to assist. I apologize for getting you involved in in this so immediate. It is... Oh my god. Brain. Please. Work. Wait. Like... Anything. I apologize for getting you involved in this so immediately. Tell me if anything comes up. Yes, ma'am. In a relationship with Olivia, feels like I'm starting to see the cro the, the crooks of this. But there are still things I don't know. I'll ask her directly. He's still sleeping. Daisy ass. So we gotta ask. Olivia? Yes? Excuse me, I wanted to talk for a bit. Oh, now it's fine. I can assist you. If I can assist you, Annie. Um, I was told that you and Mr. Lucas are dating. Is this true? My, so you've heard. Yes, it's true. I've been dating him for a few years now. Mr. Lucas is quite the womanizer, isn't he? Yes, and yes he is, but I can't put too much blame on him, because that is just part of who he is. Did the... Was that like a... I'm never gonna ask. Were you doing anything last night? No, as soon as work was done, I went straight to bed. At least, I think so. It has me worried how everyone is saying they're missing memories. It's been happening often? Yes, especially recently. Even a few guests have said they've lost memories. When did this start? These things became quite frequent around the time that boy showed up. Though, some customers have started 
coming explicitly to forget their troubles. Ah, I see. Is there anything else you want to ask? <laughs> no, no, I'm fine for now. Oh? You can come back to ask anytime. Thank you. I'll be here if you need me. Alright. This is starting to get kind of complicated. It would be really bad to have my own memories taken while I'm investigating. Damn it. I can't just... I can just feel it. This is gonna be a pain. Mm. It's morning. Up is gone. I'll go look for him. Oh. Mr. Captain! Oh. Is he bleeding? What the fuck? Haven't seen you in a while, miss. So, if Mr. Captain's here, the where's the corpse? <laughs> no, no. Different kind of case today. Different kind? We heard rumored there's a dragon here, so we came to confirm. Oh, so you're too busy to talk, I guess. Once I finished up, I'll gladly talk with you. Hooray! The manager here lets us borrow the room next door for a short while. Brett's in the, in, Brett's in the room now, so he might entertain you for a bit if you ask him. You're not taking Miss, Mr. Brett along with you? Well, there's a bit of a problem with that, but there won't be any brutal killers around this time, so he's just on standby. Hmm, okay. Now, if he'll excuse me, I guess if nobody's dead, then Papa must be okay. Okay then, time to play. Yo. Oh, it's you. Been a while, and morning. I wanna talk. The captain says he's busy, so let's talk, Mr. Brett. Sure, I've already done what I can here. Why aren't you and Mr. Captain together? Couldn't I say the same about you and Papa? I don't know where Papa is, but he's not dead, so it's okay. The manager of it of this place has a whip, doesn't she? If we were fighting together, we could cut it apart. But in any other situation, I'm so absolutely terrified of those things. You got bullied with whips? More or less. Probably bullies me by flicking my forehead, so I hate that, it's scary. He does that to you? Awful. But someday I'll get strong. But someday I'll get stronger than the flicks and beat him for good. I bet you can beat whips too, Mr. Brett. I see. You may be right. I'll have to try harder. But you're already real strong. Those, uh, misty things are, like, super overpowering. <laughs> um, oh my fucking god, can you please stop messaging? I get that they don't know I'm streaming, but still... Wait, now that I think about it... Yeah, I, for I forgot to change the title of the stream. I just realized. 
I'm a stupid dumbass. Uh, Mr. Popular? I mean, you know, it's just like my family and like one friend I've had for like, like since I was like five. Oh, maybe it's hard to tell, but these are basically my wings and horns. Oh, that's right. I should tell you, I can put those out freely now. Already figured out how to use your power. That was fast. Yeah, but keeping them out wears me out really quick. Doesn't it make you tired? You always got them out, right? I always had to use them like this. It allows me to counter any attack right away. But I only keep them out because I can fully control my power. If your power is unstable, it's very dangerous to do so. It's dangerous? Yes. It's possible your power can run ammo. The boy who's accompanying the manager of this place, he might be dangerous. He's totally a dragon, right? But no wings. Maybe a lack of control over his power is causing only his horns to appear. Or maybe he's using his power unconsciously. It's not definite. But I do not think he's a dragon. Wait, but I do think he's a dragon. I don't know, I, I missed it. Uh, he was super when I visited. So I didn't get the chance to ask him. Man, so many mysteries. Damn it. Out to hell. Oh, all to hell. Why did you learn that kind of language? Papa says that stuff all the time when he doesn't know something. Hmm. As I thought, you... He ought to be the... He ought to be torn limb from limb. Good to see you, Captain. It's the Captain. The manager firmly insists that the boy is a human. And he didn't show any signs of waking. I withdrew from the I withdrew for the time being. Is that so? Are you not busy anymore? I suppose that won't be until the boy wakes up. Oh. I wanna know some more. Should I talk to the captain? Actually, what does uh what is it? I wanna talk more. Mr. Brett, that tie in your hair is so sparkly and cool. This? I got it from a dragon child in the care of the force. Cool. And those accessories on your belt too? That's right. I've gotten a lot of gifts from people as good luck charms. Even the captain's eye patch came from the children. Oh, it's, a, it's an eye patch. I thought this motherfucker was bleeding. Because he can just regenerate any lost eyes. But you can see through the patch, so it's no problem. Are these children around my age? Yes, many of those in our care are child dragons. Lots of kids. Because they can't control their powers, many have immense power, but can hardly use it. They have tried to take advantage of this to get dragons to use their powers for them. My abilities would be useful to spies and such, for example. Now that I know why I was born with powers con convenient for those for those sorts. I wonder if I was born for some convenient reason too. Who knows? We still can't really say why dragons are born. I guess it's not like bad dragons are born from bad humans. When they've, when they've just been born, 
they don't know good from bad. Most dragons earnestly follow the orders of their parent, so to speak. Though, once they grow up, if they feel like it, they can certainly stop doing so. Are there grown up dragons with the police too? There are quite a few in similar standing to myself. Most join the police and do work for us. How do you become a grown up dragon? They are really tall. Realize your power. Learn how to use it and acquire knowledge. If you do all that, eventually you'll be an adult dragon. Got it. Thanks for telling me all that stuff. Don't mention it. I'm glad to be of service. You can have this too. I was giving them far more than I could eat. Candy, hooray! If I talk to him. You'll be alright if you already learn how to use your powers. If you go too far beforehand, they can become unstable and uncontrollable. Okay. We're not getting anywhere if we can't talk to that boy. Can we talk right now? Yeah, that's fine. Hmm, what should I ask? Oh yeah, Mr. Captain, how old are you guys? Our ages? I'm unsure. I believe they lived around 100 years. Brett's lived for 10 or so. 17 years. The dragons really don't change much as they age. That's right. Some dragons are roughly Brett's size when... When they're free. How old's Papa? When I first met him, he seemed about 17. He seemed about 7 or 8. Now I would guess he's around 20 more or less. You met him that far back? Yes. He was part of a group of children about his age living in the slums. He was sort of the boss of the group and day by day he did thievery. I've had friends? Yes. Sometimes he would act as a collective. Other times he would act alone. But some years later, the children vanished when an incident befell the town. Years after that, we fought him all we fought him all alone. Where'd his friends go? We did find some of the children in far off towns. But one of them has never been seen since. They seem to be the weakest of the group, you see. So they may Though they may well have died when they were separated. I see. Our Papa's friends died. The strong eat the, the strong eat the weak. It's just how it goes. Then I gotta be stronger. Heck, I'll get stronger than Papa. And be the one to protect it and be the one protecting him. I like your determination. You have my support. Oh yeah, where did Papa go? I saw him in the hall downstairs earlier. Okay, thanks. Don't hurry up too much. You'll trip and fall. I'm fine. Kids are always cheery, huh? Just make sure you don't trip. Talk more. Can I talk to you a little more? Sure, I don't really mind. What kind of place did Papa leave before? That's a town with plenty of gang violence. It's trying to calm down now. One day periodically to deal with one of, with one thing or another. Things just kept copping up. While I was doing that, I found them in a back alley in the corner of town. They must have lost their parents or be abandoned or been abandoned, because they were living rather well. Hey, can we whisper about something? Hmm? Like this? Do the police people? Ever shelter humans? Well, no, only dragons. Like Brett, none of our dragons are particularly trusting of humans. In fact, there are there are very few human members at HQ. However, the force itself was made by humans. 
But with the guidance of the captain who came before me, we now protect people and dragons. Was the captain before you a dragon? No, a human. She was the first human I ever saw in my life. Let's see... Oh! So, um, the vampires in Vermintown Place... In Vermintown Place... Uh... What happened with that? If you don't just take in humans, don't you just let them die? No, don't worry. There are sort of a rehabilit rehabilitation facility where you can send humans who can't control themselves. That vampire girl didn't know how to handle her immense power. So she's learning how there. It's a different line of work from what the police do. Once she's deemed safe, we... she'll be able to go back. Her brother decided to go there with her until she can come back. I'm dropping by every now and then, but there's really nothing to worry about. Oh, okay. Thanks for all the inf... inf um... Thanks for all the information. Come to me if you ever have any trouble. Have this too. Uh, I got way too many of these from the Dragon Children. Thank you so much! Yay! Uh, what's over here? Oh, that's... Yeah. Huh? I was just about to go wake you up, save me the trouble. I got up a while ago. I was talking with the captains. Oh, right. What are they doing here? Not a corpse in sight. They said they had business with the dragon kid. Wonder where they got that info from. I'd like to meet whatever informant they've got. Want to go ask? No, not really. I'll go look into it myself. Now let's move. First the boy William. First the boy William. We'll talk to him. He's up? Yeah. I heard them taking... I heard them talking in the room earlier. Let's go. Huh? Did I check over there? Alright, well. Hope this can be the last time. It's getting annoying. I mean, sure, maybe I re -app. Oh, maybe I reap. I reap what I sow. But, I don't remember, so... What do I know? Oh? Something happened? No. Don't need her right now. Wait, before I talk to him... Talk to her. William? You went to Olivia's room. Olivia's quite skilled at entertaining children. I'm not detain, no, maintain a positive attitude as well. Good morning. I want to talk a little, is that okay? Huh? Um, yes. Can I go somewhere else? Where? The hall outside, please. Wonder why. Guess we have to. I don't think anyone will be listening here. Ask me anything. Will, are you a dragon? Hey. I don't know either. Miss Sophia tells people I'm human though. Is she often worrying over you? Yeah, and not just me. She worries for Mr. Lucas and Miss Olivia and Tom and Mars.
She's even concerned for customers she doesn't really know. And lately she's been really worried about the incidents with Mr. Lucas. Do you think you're human? It's supposed to be dragons who can do magic and stuff, right? And what magic is that? I can... I can eat dreams. Yeah. So you are like me. When you eat dreams, is there a monster of sorts that comes out of you when you eat? No, not really. There's this cotton candy stuff that floats over people's heads. I just suck it up. Don't take that out of context. When they forget all about that dream. If I stare at it, I can see what what's in the dream too. So no monsters that go rampaging, huh? So I suppose you must be related to the people here losing their memories, right? No. I'm I'm not. I'm I'm usually with Miss Sophia and I'm always studying, so I hardly even move. And these things happened before I came. Well, you lied. We'll ask we'll ask you again after this. Effie, clean up. Mealtime. Happened before I came. Lie. Dumb oh, fuck. Okay. Why'd you lie? Because, um, Sophia. What about her? Uh, did you still want to ask something? <laughs> no, that's fine. Okay, goodbye. Damn it. Took him. Our memories. He calls it eating dreams, I guess. Settles it. Williams of memory eating dragon. You took our memories? How do you know, Al? I was taking notes while he wasn't looking. But now I can't remember what I've written here. Good thing I've been taking these then. Let's talk to the manager next. Got it. Alright, can I speak to your manager? Yes. Would you mind taking us for a bit? That's alright. I'll do what I can. I asked you this I asked you this before, but why did you wait this long to contact the police? And this is the fifth time. If this had been that frequent. Lucas being stabbed or strangled or burned. It's all too common for them for the man. There are always minor injuries, so I couldn't be too concerned. Next about William. Miss, do you think he's a human or do you think he's a dragon? He says he eats dreams, but he's just playing around. William's just a fine human. Those monsters appear when people tell lies. Hello, Kyle Wilson. How you doing? Because I'm a dragon and I eat lies. We'll ask you again after this. Yes. Um, I'm not worried. They're just minor injuries. Happens to him nearly daily. 
That's a lie. I think. Maybe. Ow. Grenade! God damn it, hell painted. You little shit. Can you please die? How much damn health do you have? Finally. Okay. Ugh, gross, this is the truth. It is? God damn it. So, hold on, let me go heal. I can't fight with Hal like at 1 HP. Oh shit. Minor injuries. Um, Wim is a human, what? Fire! Oh, wow! Oh, you are a beast! I'm not worried. You're very worried about Mr. Lucas, aren't you? And you were relat and you were reluctant to contact anyone else. Fuck. I skipped it. Correct. Why? Does it have to do with Will? Maybe you didn't know, but the police shel but the police shelter dragons. Whether those dragons are subject to unfair treatment, or if their power is unstable. What if their prize is unstable and they can't control it? I found out that rumors were spreading about him. I thought if I called the police, they would look at William. And I thought, for sure, they would take him away. I did do some research into dragons, but I haven't had the faintest idea why William's power is unstable lately. He's suffering so much. But my, but in my ignorance, I can't, can't help him at all. I failed as a parent, and I was very worried about Lucas too. But he wasn't getting seriously hurt, so I didn't want to worry because of William. I need to protect them, but I can't protect any, anyone. I'm pathetic. 
This is also shameful. I'll do what I can. Miss Sophia, maybe ignorance was a part of your actions, but there's no shame in it. You were doing everything you could. So for William and so for Lucas. Mr. Lucas, I'll ensure that this is resolved. Thank you so much. Also, can I ask you two more questions? Ask away. Mr. Lucas and Miss Olivia, have they really never so much as fought? Not as far as I know, but my memories may not be accurate, because William may have eaten them. Although, yes, I feel there have been more things being broken lately, and I don't know why that is. Have Miss Olivia and William been together more lately? Yes, they have. He's been... He's very often... He's very often with Olivia, and she's not working. Thank you for speaking with us. That'll be all. I hope you can help us. Can you really resolve this? Yeah. We should be close. Let's go to Olivia. Oh? Something happened? Do you mind if I talk to you for a moment? Yes, go ahead. If I can be of help. I'll get right to the point. It's about this. Well, about all of these incidents with Mr. Lucas. Are you the one responsible? Now why would you think that? Mr. Lucas is loathsome. Mr. Lucas is loathsome. Womanizing is apparent. Me okay, let me try that again. Mr. Lucas is loathsome, womanizing is apparent. But? Miss Olivia, I also hear that you're quite jealous. So, I wondered if perhaps you strangled Mr. Lucas and put him on the cross every time. Even if you're right, what's the point without evidence? That's something I'm going to confirm now. Have you been getting along poorly with Mr. Lucas without constant with constant fighting? I've told you this before, but well he is quite the arrogant playboy. I'm not dissatisfied. We don't fight or anything. Because that's part of the man I adore. What are these? This girl here is basically a lie detector. Getting fed up with explaining, huh? Hmm, I see. I suppose I get it. Well, I'll ask your explanation once these are cleared, cleaned up. Oh, I'm actually getting kind of full now. Well, they're not gonna go. They're not gonna go away any other way, so quit complaining. But like... I'm tired of the little ones. Just eat. I'll give you candy later. Woohoo! Wait, I... Yeah, I need to go deal. Uh... Wait. Actually, no, I don't. We don't fight. Like... Triple knife. I'll eat what... I'll need to heal. No, I definitely need to. Alright, let's go heal. Um... Really quickly, just in case. Um... I should also probably save, now that I think about it. Because, uh, I don't... Finally. Wait. I can type... Did I go into the wrong room? No, that's... No, that's our room. What? Oh, no. I can't heal. 
What? Fuck. I can't heal. No. My biggest weakness. As I thought, you were fighting after all. The manager informed me that things were getting broken for unknown reasons. Perhaps those reasons are unknown because you're using William to erase all memory of it. He's been with you often when he's not working with Miss Sophia or studying. That's why I suspect you have an involvement in all of this, Miss Olivia. I see. If I'm wrong, could you provide an alternate explanation? You want to know? Let's play a game. If you win, then fine, I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you anything. Do I have your word? Yes, and look. None of those mon- And look, none of those monsters, right? I'm telling the truth. What's the game? Have any experience with blackjack or poker? I've never played them. Then, let's play memory. You must know how to play that, don't you? But, with some special rules. We pick a value, and whoever matches two of that value wins. I'll let you pick. What value t I'll let you pick what value to match. Ace. Ace would be good. So the little lady So the little lady says, what about you? Yes, Ace is fine. Let's have a practice round. I'll go first. Four and eight. No dice. Can I flip some? Go ahead. Yay. Two and two. Congratulations. But the rules are to match two aces, so sorry. Man. Ace and five. Effie, remember that. Effie, remember that ace. Remember where that ace is. I'll remember it too if you can't. Look out for aces. Showing. Look out for aces showing up anywhere else. Then we can win. Okay, I'll try. And the gun goes bang, bang, bang. My, you. My, you teach the girl a rather odd way to count. Different ace from before. Hmm. That last ace was here, I think. No, the ace is. Huh? What is it? Flip a card before we all die of old age. Effie, flip one at random. Wrong one. Then it's my turn. Ace of diamonds, ace of spades. I win. Got an idea of the game? Ready for the real match? Is it alright if we add some special rules of our own? True. It wouldn't be fair to give one of us the advantage. First, make it best of three. Whoever wins two matches is the overall winner. Second, after each turn, the cards in play should all be shuffled. Both sound fine to me. Let's add those rules. How about we have our game in the game room downstairs? Okay, that's fine. Oh, and one more thing. Can we have a match? Can we have the match a little later tonight? Very well. Meet me there at 7. Yes, ma'am. He completely took our memories there. I had no idea where the ace was. Do you actually remember in the first place? <laughs> What do we do? 
There's no way we can win against that. I've got an idea. Let's check out the place we're having the game. Uh, the game room that is like over here, I think. Yeah. It's made of clear glass. It's see-through. Pretty. Specifically made to prevent cheating. Hmm. There's enough space for a prison to fit in there. Can we do something with that? Yeah. It's not cheating if there aren't any rules. We'll plan out a way to ensure we win two rounds. Let's get to our room. You wear that blanket over your head. Okay. Can you see my face with that on? Yep. Clearly? Even the scar on my left on the left cheek? Yeah, real clear. Hmm. Dragons must have better vision than people. What's this for? It's a way to win one round. It's a way to win one round. Two if we're not caught. Hmm. That's not much of a guarantee, is it? Yeah, that's why you've got your precious chump card. That's an ace, right? Oh yeah, Mr. Lucas gave it to me. It's got my name, but he said I could write. He said I could rub it off. Good. Now it's guaranteed. Listen, Effie. I'll explain what we're going to do tonight. I'll say it three times top, so remember it. Okay. It's hot in this blanket. We can take it off now. Almost time. You gotta get there before them. I'm sleepy from waiting. Listen, the plan relies on you. We can't do it without you. Staying awake? Now let's go. Wait. Actually, um, I think that's good. Okay. Let me actually save. Sorry for the wait. Hmm? Where's that girl? Oh, she went to the bathroom. That's not a problem to start without her, is it? I suppose not. Also, don't worry, but the air conditioning is really cold. Do you have a blanket? Why, are you alright? Wait a moment. Is that sufficient? Sorry to trouble you. I think I'm fine now. Then let us begin. I went first before, so why don't you go? Okay. Three and seven. Nope. Two and king. No. Queen, ace. Ah, an ace. Alas. Ace. Here it comes. Your hand faltered. I'll flip one in a second. Here. Ace of spades, ace of clubs. Matched. <laughs> Congratulations. But you mustn't cheat. What are you hiding under that blanket there? What do you mean? When you chose the ace, I saw... saw it shake a little. That was no shiver. What are you hiding? Were you hiding something in your cape that moved up to the front? 
Was that little shaking a tap of your foot to tell you where the ace was? You can tell me, Effie. You're so good, Miss Olivia. I worked so hard to learn how to signal it, too. <laughs> I'm very skilled at seeing through those tricks. But I'll let you have that victory. And since you won, you can go first again. Right. Ace five. I want to mix them up. Don't be so rough. Don't be so rough that they fly off the table. Okay. My two aces, I win. Well, and to keep going. You can't pull a cheap trick anymore. I'll play. This hasn't been settled yet. I'll go first, of course. Nope. Nope. Ace and king. Ace. Ace of diamonds. Ace of hearts. Match! Congratulations! As I promised, you may ask me anything. Oh, and I'm going to do that. So, about me and Lucas. Yes? Well, it's true, we've been fighting constantly as of late. Because Lu Lucas keeps talking with and touch and touching other women despite having me. He can't exactly be mine alone anymore. Don't you find it terrible? Getting at him does no good. So I did those things to him and his body might learn. Though he's had plenty of trouble with other women still. Now if the manager found out about us fighting, she'd know it was me right away, yes? Thus, I had William help me to clean it, to clean the erase dot. Another expression of my love. Have a problem with it? Effie, this is the kind of girl who shackles guys and throws, throws away the keys. Don't grow. Don't grow up to be like her, okay? But I don't know how to shackle nor... I don't know how to shackle or not shackle nobody. <laughs> Any other questions? Fuck, I hit my headphones. You're like turning yourself in? Why? Am I doing anything wrong? I think I know what will happen if I tell the police what you just told me. Sure, yes, I suppose. But that last match, when you, sh when you shuffled the cards at the start of the turn, you casually slid in an ace of hearts, didn't you? I've got a good eye for this, you know. And the card placement, I knew all of them from the start. What I told William to erase was the location of another ace. So you retained the memory of your of the ace you brought in. Shame on you. One mustn't let their cheating be exposed, no matter what their what the variety. By the way. Hey, yo, hold up. Oh, yo, that face, though. I didn't promise I'd let you go unharmed. Got a full on yandere over here. Ow. Effie. Feels like I sprained something. But I guess. Dragon should be fine after a fall like that. Can we get out of here? This freaks. Gotta hurry out of here. Not getting up too soon. Not opening. 
eyes are flooding in. Weird. I wouldn't think she. I wouldn't think she'd be that lost in lies. So. Ooh. Ah, I messed up. I get it. Not much time then. Gotta get Effie up. Ow! Get up, runt. Food. Hmm? But I just ate. That was yesterday. Come on. You gotta get some... You gotta be getting hungry. Hmm? I guess, if you say so. Good. And get to it. What are you staring at? Oh, you kind of stink. Shut up, damn it. A little better now? Nah, you still smell just like... Just normal life. What if I told you I don't smell? You don't smell. Good. Now clean this up. And when you please, that'd be good. That's the end of them. But they'll keep flooding out. Gotta eat the source. Is it somebody taking over with lies again? Yeah, it is. Why does everybody lie? It's so exhausting. That's humans for you. Don't bother yourself with it. But you can die if you get taken over by them. Since you're a liar, Hal, sometimes I wonder if someday you'll die from it. Since I can't tell what your lies are, and I can't eat them for you. So that's what you've been thinking about now. Listen, I don't tell lies. Even if I was lying, I'm just a liar, not a liar. Or whatever. Don't... They don't owe me. Owe me. Just don't worry about it. I can take care of myself. And I'll protect you too, so don't waste your time with that nonsense. Here they come again. Can't be sticking around here any longer. I have to clean up. There we go. No end to him. Ow. Yeah? What? Um, I had this thought about seven towns back. In the one with the vampires. Are these your lies, Hell? Why would you say that? They're more jumbled than... They were more jumbled before, so I couldn't tell, but not so much this time, and they taste a little different from the others. Huh? So you can already tell. So? Does it have to do with that friend you lost when you were little? Who told you that? The captain. Got a blabber mouth. Yeah, a lot happened. But it's all in the past. 
It's done, it's finished. And? And I'm sorry if I couldn't protect them. What the? That doesn't sound like you at all. Probably because I'm busy making people sad and mad. That's okay, it's okay. I'll protect you no matter what. I'll beat up all the lies. You don't beat them, you eat them. And you ought to be able to protect yourself before you spell a line like that. If you can't protect yourself, you can't protect anybody. Can't you protect each other? Hal protects me and I protect Hal. Or does that not work? You little... Ah, fine if you say so. Yeah. You seriously are a weirdo. Get your hands off me. You're gonna stink. That's okay. You're stinkier. Really. Hey. You sure you can just bust down the door all flashy? Hey, it's an emergency. I got permission from the captain and the manager. What happened? Is it a lion loose? No. Well, maybe. The dragon child is running. Well. Sorry, but I don't know how to stop a wild dragon. That's what we're here for. But this one seems to be protected by allies. By lies. Our attacks can't hit them. They're ineffective against lies. Huh? Huh. That's how it works. Never noticed since we're the only ones who ever try. The more you know, the more info to sell. We can't sell it till we find out why people can't hit the moron. Look, this is no time to chat. Yeah, the king's running around rampant now. It's not too bad. Luckily, he's still in there somewhere. Got it. But, there's another big liar. If you don't beat them first, the dragon... Kids' lives are just gonna come back. So let us focus on that first. Right, I'll tell the captain. We're watching him in our room. So when you're done, come quickly to. Boy, you weak. Oh, shut up. I'll go on ahead. Hey. Can't that guy go through walls? Wish he just carried us like before. Maybe he doesn't like you. It really hurts to hear you say it so bluntly. Let's go. There's lads all around. Watch out for the goofier ones. We ought to avoid them if possible. Right. Are we? Okay. Can we go heal? Wait, hold on. I almost run into that. Please? Yes. Okay. We got this. In the bag. No, not that one. Um, I'm guessing it's like here, right? Or not. The other way, I'm guessing. 
Or also not. Hmm. So, upstairs and like, in like the rooms? Not here. This way? Where the fuck are they? Is it, are they outside maybe? Uh, I can't go outside. But I guess not. That. Wait, so where are they? Did I miss the dialogue or something? Two strikes again, I don't think that matters right now. Are they in one of these rooms? There they are! What the fuck? Why are they in such a random ass room? Then you have something else to do first? Go we'll watch him here. You handled the other part. What well, other part? Olivia collapsed, and we heard William howl. Olivia was taken by the police, but she doesn't remember what happened. And Lucas, he hasn't been found. Where could he have gone? Other part? What other part? Did I miss something? Don't tell me this is him. Oh my god, I just- I walked around him like 30 times. <laughs> Who's this? Eat and find out. Let's go. There's one more. So, there, oh my god. Let's go. There's one more. So let's wrap it up quick. Oh wow. He's actually like shaped like a dragon. That's actually kind of cool. Stop hitting fucking howl. Poor guy.
Are you fucking kidding me? Um... Oh my fucking god. Hmm. Okay. Get another one. Do that. Stop. Oh no, I'm gonna die next turn. Unless. Okay, um... Motherfucker, I'm all the way back here. Um... That is fine, though, because, again, the dialogue does skip pretty quickly. Right now it's just kind of tedious, but it's not too bad. Yeah, we are pretty close to like where we were before, it's not too bad. Um... Okay. All right. Now we just need to avoid. And oh, ooh, ooh, no, 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 no. We don't speak the same language, my boy. There we go. Take 
rest. Cool. Now we're fully healed up, and actually I'm gonna save, just because I know we're gonna need to. I keep forgetting that we can. Oh no no no, go back. Okay, let's just... Got a bounce set up. Uh, bounce down and, and set up. Carry on, soldier. Yeah, I mean we're. I'm finishing in an hour. I'm pretty sure this game is like. I'm. I'm. I'm pretty sure. I'm. Like I should be almost done. Damn, triple knife is OP. Holy shit. Don't worry, mate. Right. Oh, wait, actually. <gasps> oh, my God, yes, he's stupid. really slow and careful keep that to when you're short of money and food got it yeah mr lucas you okay as okay as i look so you were lying you remembered who uh, you remembered who was strangling you and crucifying you all along why do you think that is? Well, Olivia did it as punishment for your womanizing. So if your memory of it were erased, there'd be no point. It'd just be, it'd just repeat itself. And you really overstressed the point. Oh wait, and you really overstressed the point of not remembering. But FB led me to think that the victim had no reason to lie. So I overlooked you. Want me to praise you as an expert now? Yeah, I remembered. I sowed the seeds. Now I gotta reap them. I was... I was stopping Sophie from calling the police. But this time, she, she got through. And there's William, too. We were trying to figure out what to do when this happened. Then this happened. Listen, Lucas. Kindness made from lies can't protect you or anybody. Sure, it's going to sure, it's going to take time to get out of your stupid ass contrarian habits. But just stop lying. Be able to protect one woman before you reach for another. Um, you sure you should tell him that? You can't just tell a liar to stop lying. But thanks, I feel kind of relieved. I'll be sure to talk with Sophie tomorrow. 
And I gotta apologize for getting William into this mess. Oh yeah, the drunk kid's in a bad. Oh yeah, the drunk kid's in a bad way too. Wait, for real? I gotta. Yeah. Take it easy. Well, time to the rest. Go back to your room. Get rest for the day. Damn it. Alright. You better have this. Let's go. Last one, so keep at it. Alright. Uh, fuck. Apparently I have one more match. Okay. Let's heal. Uh, sleep. Oh my god, that gave me a heart attack. Guessing he's going to be in here. No. Where's that little fuck? Wait, actually, let me save. Oh wait, that's Lucas, never mind. This little shit. Um Finish your other business? Yeah, it's done. I see. Sorry to throw you through sorry to throw you through the gauntlet, but help us out here too. Thankfully, his wings and horns help him evade deadly attacks. He's so young. So if you hurt him too much, he might die. Right, got it. Once the lies are cleared up, we'll restrain him. Please. Safe skull. Cool. Is not completely gone yet. Gotta hurry. Yeah, let's make this the end. Oh my god, that is cool. Um, fuck. Okay, um, not that one. Big lie. And this. Okay, soaring power. Okay, is this bide? Um,. Yes, easy. All right, they're off. Go ahead. Thanks. This will be quick since it's not too severe. Oh, how are you feeling? Uh, William, 
Miss Sophia. S sorry. I'm sorry. Will, run. What now? Let's go check on him. Oh wait, Will ran. Oh. William. Miss Sophia, I'm sorry. No, it's my fault. Because of the job I had, I was always tormented by bad dreams. I tried to pull my feelings aside, but I'm human after all. The one day William, then one day William, your egg appeared. And you said you could eat dreams. I, I know, in that moment, said I wanted you to erase the source of all those dreams, yes? Yes, that's right. You looked so hurt, so I hate them all. Then it seemed like you could sleep well. I thought it'd be done. I thought I'd done good. But when customers here had bad dreams too, I secretly ate them. But if I ate good dreams, it'd make people unhappy. I saw that in the storybook. Soon, I thought I had to eat all the bad dreams. So then... I'm sorry. I pushed this all on you. If we can erase bad dreams, if we don't carry them, we can't grow stronger. From now on, I won't run away. So I can protect everyone. You don't need to put yourself anymore. Miss Sophia. I'm re really sorry. So, when Miss Manager made a wish, Will's egg showed up. Yes, that's right. It was a desperate time. I had a very strong wish. Personally, I wonder if dragons are a gift from God to grant such wishes. Huh, I'm glad stuff got settled. It's getting pretty late. Let's rest for today. Thanks for everything. No, thank you. Oh wait, no, thank you. Dragons are born from people's thoughts and wishes? Good night. I'm sorry I troubled you. Night, Will. Night, Miss Sophia. Sleepy. Last night was way too noisy. Are we leaving town? Well, we did what you came for. We checked up on the dragon. There's nothing more troublesome than dealing with following couples. Get any info? Yeah, enough. Should say goodbye to the manager before we go. <laughs> that is not where the manager is. Where is the manager? I would like to speak to the manager. What the fuck? Oh, that they were right in front of us. I truly must thank you for what you've done. It just pains me to see you off without proper thanks. No, you've helped a lot. I've spoken with the police. They said William can stay here. But as I've told you, my knowledge of dragons is rather me. Me either. So if you ever come again, I would appreciate your knowledge. <laughs> I'll ask for money to tell anybody anything, so I suggest giving up. 
Then maybe I'll just make you something tasty. Ooh, let's come back. I'll try hard to protect what's important to me. It just took me long to notice what it was. Maybe it's true that the most important things are the hardest to notice. What do you feel is important? What do you feel is important? Miss Sophia, the others, living the way I do. Well, those are all the things you can see. It just differs between people, how important some things are. No real big difference between visible and, or invisible. But the more visible and close something is, the harder it is to notice its value. I see. Then I'll have to pay more attention to my surroundings. Of course you... Wait. Oh. Yeah. Convinced. Dumbass. Caused you a load of trouble, didn't I? Yeah. You better grow out of your habits quick. Sure, sure. Thinking it's incurable, though. They may as well be showy about it instead of secret. Harder to notice what's in plain sight, you know? Oh, stop it. If I did that, my head would kiss my head goodbye. From now on, if this man gets any funny ideas, I'm going to promptly punish him for his indecency. Sounds good. Maybe I'll get fixed. Maybe you'll get fixed up quicker than expected. Yeah, if I survive. Well then, we'll be taking our leave. Will you come back to visit? Yeah, not bye bye. See you later. Yeah. <laughs> we hope to see you again. Finally! And we only got half an hour left. Oh, we can finally leave. Oh, and my arm crack is, of course, because I'm a broken car at this point. You got some beating it? Yeah, I beat a lot of games today, actually. That's surprising. Uh, there is one more episode, but there's no way I can do that in half an hour, so it'll probably get its own stream. Also, on my back. Uh, for the next half an hour, I don't think I can play anything. Because I don't think I can beat anything in half an hour. Oh, is it true dragons are born from people's wishes and thoughts? Yeah, sounds more plausible than any other idea I've had. So what's your wish, Leo? Don't know. What? That face just now, you totally know. Hey, mind if we stop by a grave? It's on the way, and it might be yours. Uh, alright, alright, don't walk so fast. I used the wrong voice, but alright. To be continued? Oh, let's see this. How? Age 23, height 170 centimeters, skills, lying, likes beer, money, and women. Dislikes annoyances. A con artist, he tells lies like he breathed, like he tells lies like, like their breaths. Borrowed the name and look of a napping youth nearby. Athena, age 6 months, appearance 4 years, height 69 centimeters, 69, 96, <laughs> 69, nice, uh, ability eating lies, likes papa and sweets, dislikes writing, a dragon girl who feeds on lies, energetic and inquisitive, she recently learned how to write her name. 
Tom Lott, age 28, height 178 centimeters, skills, uh, weightlifting, likes meat, dislikes using his head. The elder of the wolf twins guard, uh, guards the resort, the resort's entrance, turns human on full moons. A uh, shadowy muscle man. Mars Lot, age 28, height 178 centimeters, skills, mental maps, likes maths and fishing, nerd, dislikes noise. Okay, I agree with doing that. Uh, the younger of the wolf twins, guards the resort's entrance, turns human on full moons. Always calm and composed. Olivia Cameron, age 26, height 162 centimeters, skills, card magic tricks, likes Lucas and T, dislikes frogs, you bitch. Uh, a worker at the resort, currently handles the casino. Once she falls for someone, she gets painfully attracted. Lucas Balliol. Age 24, height 172 centimeters, skills trickery, likes beer, money, and women, dislikes restraints. A stitched up resort employee currently handles the bar. The stitches are for style, but some of them are real. Sophia Juanel, or Juanel, age 25. Height 165 centimeters, skills, magic tricks, likes children, dislikes alcohol. The manager of the resort. She does magic in the grand hall. Used to be an executioner. William, just William. Age four months, appearance four years. Height six, uh, no, 92 centimeters. Uh, ability eating memories, likes Employees and guests, dislikes talking to strangers. A memory eating dragon boy helps Sophia with her magic tricks. Um, though a drag, uh, though a dragon, he has a sheep like horns and angelic wings. Neil Macefield, age around 100, appearance around 30. Height 192 centimeters, ability immortality, likes the world, people, and dragons, dislikes evil, an immortal dragon. He serves as the captain of the police force. He's often taking his sweet time. That's the same as the last game. And Brett Graves, around 17, appearance about the same. Height, 166 centimeters. Ability, phasing through objects. Likes dragons, reading. Likes dragons and reading. And dislikes people. A young dragon of shadow, vice captain of the police force. Enter dragons, but the test people recently started growing out his hair, and that is all of them. Let's look at some of the other mentions. Uh, oh, That was pretty cool, not gonna lie. That was also pretty cool. Holy fuck. Okay, um how much of the end there? Oh yeah, he does have two different colored thumbs. Shit. That was interesting. I kinda wish it wasn't a silhouette. That was cool.
and apparently there's a bad ending that I am too lazy to find. That is different with a power screen, yes. Oh, okay. Hmm. 